welcome, come in, welcome. Today I'm going to show you my way of making ramen. I know Shin makes a beef bone broth, but why don't they make a chicken bone broth? I don't know, but here, I'm gonna show you right here how to make a chicken bone broth. So these are the noodles that I will be using today. It's a Japanese ramen noodle and they're fresh. They haven't been frozen, they're not dry, they're just fresh with flour on them. So let me show you how I make my ramen. This here is a sipping broth, but you can use it for a soup broth as well. Look how opaque that broth is. It doesn't say how long to cook these for, so I'm gonna guess five to eight minutes. This is QP Mayo. And if you don't know what QP Mayo is, it's just a Japanese mayonnaise. It's a little sweeter. Time to add in our seasoning package. I'm gonna add a little bit of chili oil. Also had some beef in the fridge from a day ago. Just gonna add that on the side. I know it's chicken, but still, who cares? Add chicken if you'd like. I have some green onion. As well as some nori. I couldn't find just nori at the store. This is a uh, nori sesame. So pretty. All right, guys, that's it. All there is left to do is eat, but first, I have to take a thumbnail. Guys, I forgot one thing. Our soy eggs that I made yesterday. Time to try. This is so good. It's nice and thick now. The noodles are just cooked perfectly. Oh, that smells delicious. Mm. First, I want to try the broth. Oh, 
that spice. It's got the kick from the shin. Ooh, my ear is ringing. This is good. This is delicious. Wow, what a beautiful noodle. I love a good yellow twiggy twiggy noodle. Mmm. Try some of that beef that's coated in that beautiful juice. Mmm. Delicious. This is freaking phenomenal. And it doesn't take long. At all. Mmm. Great. Great alternative to your everyday ramen. I suggest you try this. There is no chicken bone broth anywhere that I have seen anyways. So when it comes to shit. So if you really want to try it, I suggest you try it. If you don't like spice, you saw less mm, obviously spicier ramen pack, but shin, you gotta have the shin. I'm telling you, you gotta have the shin seasoning pack. So this is amazing. I'm gonna let Vic try. He's gonna love it. Okay guys, there's the beef. Wow. Wow. How's the broth? So good. It's really, um, really well made. So easy. Not a lot of time needed. You'd be ah. surprised. Like, we live in Canada, you wouldn't think that you could have, like, authentic Asian tasting, like, soups and, and noodles and stuff. We do. Guys, it's running down my chin. Mm. Mm. So good. good. Okay, guys, this is amazing. Like I said before, try it. If you like chicken and you like a rich chicken broth, yeah. And you're looking for something to do a little bit differently than your average ramen, and you have like five minutes in your day, go ahead and do this. Well, that concludes my video for today. Please give a thumbs up if you like this video. Comment down below, because I love to hear from you guys. Let me know where you guys are watching from. Subscribe, share, share this video. If you think it's a great idea and you know somebody that loves ramen, share this video with them, because yeah, they'll love this. That's the best ramen. It really is. All right, guys, I'll see you in my next video. Thanks for watching, bye. Right, guys. Yeah, I know. Come on, Mmm. Mmm. Oh my gosh, this is good. Just try your egg. Mm-mm. Wow. You like it? Wow. Really? Yeah. It doesn't even taste like soy. This is crazy good. Mm -hmm. Spicy but crazy good. This is like restaurant good. Mm -hmm. It's better than restaurant good. Mm -hmm. I could more than the other two now, this is that. Oh shit, can I? It's okay. Mm.